Today we're kicking off a new series about plant-based eating. Several decades ago it was considered a radical lifestyle, believe it or not. While considered more mainstream now, misconceptions do remain about what eating plant-based really means. Here's health and wellness reporter Lauren Petty. Jen Dembski had no interest in eating vegan until her daughter came to her with an idea. She came home and said, I have a proposition for you. What if I find the meal, I grocery shopped for the food, and I cooked the food? Would you go vegan? And I said, of, well, of course. That's a no-brainer. That was five years ago, and Dembski hasn't looked back. I enjoyed it. I felt a little bit better from how I was eating, and I felt like it was something that I wanted to continue doing. So she stopped, and I kept going. Dembski even created this website, organizing a plantbasedlife.com to help others who want to eat more plant-based. Years ago, you had to be a strict vegan um, in order to join the club, and that was what you had to be. And I think times have changed, and really, you can be on the plant-based spectrum. Registered dietitian nutritionist Jen Bruning agrees. With plant-based eating, you are making plants the star of the show. There are all kinds of avenues to pursue when it comes to plant-based eating. Eating vegan means eliminating all animal foods. Vegetarians don't eat animal flesh foods. Lacto-ovo vegetarians will eat dairy and eggs, while pescatarians consume seafood. And there's a newer term, a flexitarian. What I consider myself, um, so that you occasionally eat meat or dairy. Um, there's a reducitarian, so that would mean that you're reducing the amount of, of, of meat and dairy that you eat. As a spokesperson for the Academy of Nutrition and Dietetics, Bruning says it's important people don't focus on picking a lane or a label to follow, but instead start with small dietary changes. There are so many ways to take what you already enjoy, the foods you already prepare and just bulk up the plants to make it more plant-based. Why should you consider bulking up more on plants? From cutting your cancer risk to help with your mental health. We're going to dive into the research when our plant-based eating series continues tomorrow. Lauren Petty, NBC5 News.